Welcome back, Lakeland Sports, and a chance to visit with freshman defenseman Tommy Muck. Uh, Egan is uh, where he played some high school uh, hockey, and they'll tell us uh, a little bit about how you uh, that road to Bemidji State, uh, how it all worked out for you. Um, I'd have to say it started uh, my senior year, and we played in the uh, state high school tournament. Um, I had heard about Bemidji State. They uh, had shown some interest in me after uh, watching me in the state tournament, and then um, you know, my first year of juniors in Madison, they, uh, you know, they followed me the whole way. They I actually talked to Coach Saratori um, about the first month, first month there, and you know, he followed me throughout the whole season. And then uh, we had a orientation camp just before my second year of juniors, and uh, he, that's when, um, you know, he came and he watched me there, and you know, I decided the United States where I want to go. The recruiting trail, although, you know, even maybe years ago, you jumped from high school right into college, it's still coaches are getting in touch with you right at the high school age, aren't they? Yeah, yeah, absolutely. I mean, you know, for those guys that, you know, go from high school straight to college, that's a big jump. Yeah. You know, from high school to um, the USHL where I played, that was a big jump. Um, you know, I think it's really beneficial to play. I'm um, a year junior, so I mean, it was uh, that's the path I took. Yeah, well, physical maturity yeah. too, right? I mean, you're playing against 22 year old yes. men, <laughs> type of thing. Okay, so you get to uh, Bemidji State, uh, and you understand that there's a lot of sophomore defensemen here, and a lot of guys, uh, and working your way into the lineup. Uh, how'd that go? Yeah, you know, it's it's a learning process. I mean, you gotta. Biggest thing I noticed was just the attention to details, just the little things. You know, I. Um, first first few weeks, you know, I really had to focus in on that. And I mean, it helps with, you know, those sophomores who went through it last year. You know, you look at them now from where they were last year to where they are now. You know, you just got to kind of follow in their footsteps. They've been great. They've helped me out. Um, both coaches, especially Coach Winters, just helped me out tremendously. So, you know, that's that's coaching has helped a lot. Being a, a Minnesota uh, kid, uh, did you recall uh, when Bemidji State was in the Frozen Four and, and those those days? Um, honestly, no, uh -oh. I did not. It was uh, it wasn't until you know the first time that I came here with my dad. You know, I noticed, I noticed it, and then um, I saw it on the wall. But honestly, I can say that I don't. I don't remember them being in the Frozen Four. Okay, but. It's, all, it's all good. Yeah. It's all good. Well, we hope to end uh, your career here to, to get back there. Uh, and here, it, look at uh, here we are, late uh, January as we head into Ferris State this weekend. Uh, and your thoughts, uh, what needs to be done here to, to close this thing out in league play? You know, we just we just have to continue to be good on the back end. You know, Bits is playing, Bits is playing well, and you know we gotta we gotta do what we have to in front of him to help him out. Um, you know, we're playing great team defense. We have to continue to do that and. You know, ultimately, we got to do do what we can in the offense zone to help our forwards create more offense. And, you know, we just got to continue how we're playing and just keep it simple. Good to get to know you a little better. And for some fans, uh, get to know you as well. And uh, thanks so much for this. Thank you. All right, Tommy Mock, freshman, defenseman here at Bemidji State. Back in a moment.